gorgeous. It cancelled. Wrong. There we go. Hmm. Hopefully the no, the sound isn't too loud. I guess I'll find out after recording this first one. So, hello there and welcome to Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance. Or maybe I should try to do the voice for the new trailer. Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance. <laughs> Anyway, welcome and I hope you enjoy. Select the difficulty. Yes. Wait, really? I Okay. The following demons of her summon as allies have been registered. Shikawiji, Yakshni, and Shirono. Okay. Okay. Hmm. This is a work of fiction. Any names or characters, businesses or incidents are fictitious. Any resemblance to actual persons living or dead or actual events is pretty coincidental. <laughs> pretty coincidental. When I contemplate the brevity of man's life, I am indifferent to worldly things. How many are the days I spend in thought? Long ago, the world of order was created by God, and his servants, the angels, led it on its proper course. It was in such a world that countless mortals led happy, fruitful, and prosperous lives by his grace. However, even God's world is not eternal. The pure, unsullied path that God had forged will, as fate dictates, become a muddled, poisonous swamp at the hands of humankind. Disrupted order begets chaos, and chaos will likewise be consumed by order in turn. How will these keepers of knowledge strive and perish during their final futile hours in this doomed world? Let us watch them at our leisure until the new ruler is upon the throne. What is this? A passing soul? This is a path linked to the future. The choices you make will affect the very course of the world. Stay your hand now. The soul of that girl cannot be permitted to exist. By her very nature, she will lead the world into chaos and ruin. She must remain sealed here for all eternity. 
To take the girl from this place will lead not to the future destined for this world, but to a world yet unknown. Knowing only this, will you still take her hand? Yes. forget that with a simple gesture, your decision has hastened the end of the world. We can only pray that you return to the proper path, that you find your way again. I'm getting goosebumps. They did a very good job in setting up the beginning. In Shin Megami Tensei V Vengeance, how the narrative plays out is largely determined by whether you take the girl's hand or not near the beginning of the game. <laughs> Canon of Creation is the original story. Yeah, I played through that. Canon of Vengeance is the new story. Yes. Although I'll probably replay Creation after this though. Just to see what's the differences. You know, I'm really curious. All right, listen up. Everyone should have their own personal tablets now, but it sounds like some of you still need to get them registered. Those temp accounts are about to expire. So anyone who's been putting it off better get on that. One other thing. It's been getting pretty dangerous out there. Remember the buddy system. Go back to the dorm in groups. That's it for homeroom. Thank you, sir. Students were advised to head home in groups. You should look for a classmate to walk with. Hey there! Uh... <laughs> hey! Dialogue is new. <sighs> hey. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> hey. 
Everything all right? Ah. Hey, you heading back alone? You heard that talk about it being safer to go home in groups, right? You should walk with us. I mean, not really. They've met in passing. I think Miyazu and I ran into him a couple times. Yato, something like that. Aww, you're lucky your big brother looks out for you so much, huh? Um, I guess. We're the only family we've got. I don't think it's that strange to look out for my little sister. Sure, sure. So, how about we all walk home together? You attend Joning High Join High School. Joning High School, this is a Naruto. <laughs> And not too far from there, he lives at the Joeing High School dormitory along with other students. In the commute to and from school, the shortest route is to pass through the connecting passageway at Shinagawa. The quickest way back to the dorm will be to head to the Shinagawa station with exit. Um... Okay, but I kind of want to explore though. Okay, never mind, I can't. There's no need to return to school now, young man. you wanted to talk about something? Oh, it's nothing. I've just been having these weird dreams lately. I keep hearing this distant voice, like someone far away is calling out to me. It keeps getting closer and closer, but just when it seems like they've almost found me, I wake up. And I keep having that dream every night. Kinda getting to me. I wish someone could tell me what it all means. Probably a reflection of something subconscious. Maybe you're just stressed over the future. It would make sense since... Something going on? Looks like. Here, I'll go check it out. It seems like something's happened at the station. I should take a look. Huh? 
I'm sorry, but there's been an incident inside. You'll have to take an alternate route. Wait. Uh, hey! Huh? <laughs> Is it me? <sighs> Wait, you tried to talk to her, but that girl paid you no heed and left. Apparently, she teleported. Um. Hey! Oh, hi. My brother came back, but he needed to take a call or something. Walked off somewhere. Then Tao got a message, too. She went looking for somewhere quiet to try calling back. <laughs> uh, would you mind checking up on my brother? I know he's always looking after me, but I get worried about him, too. Leave it to me. Thanks. I'll, I'll just wait here in case Tao comes back. moment <laughs> a fish <laughs> I mean technically there are demons that are fish that can fly like Azuchi and Fornia so <laughs> It's a shortcut to save. I do not remember that being a thing before. <laughs> I mean, my memory isn't exactly the best. It's been a long while since I played SMT5. And honestly, you'd think I'd remember more of it because I replayed the game like three or four times. Holy heck. I mean, I still remember the important story beats, but outside of that... All right. So word on the street is a bunch of monsters have been seen hanging around this tunnel. Uh, yo! Sheesh! Ceiling's pretty low. Pretty dark in here, too. Looks dangerous. Alright, enough screwing around. Let's go even deeper, yeah? I think we might be onto something big. Hey, what are you doing here?
creatures known as humans gained knowledge. The God of Law seated himself upon the throne of creation. He seized all knowledge from the other gods, rebuking them, so they could never dare to approach the throne. Reducing them to mere demons. The fruit of knowledge was secreted away in a paradise of his own creation. One day, a serpent sought out the mortals, seeking to tempt them into doing his will. Eat the fruit of knowledge in this paradise, and you will become more like God. The serpent's goal was to revive the war of the myriad gods. Oblivious to the serpent's machinations, the mortals of each realm ate the fruit, one after another, without fail. The knowledge they devoured then bound to their souls, birthing humans closer to gods. When the god of law saw this, he banished all humanity from his paradise in a fit of rage. Humans, you curious creatures infused with precious knowledge. Know that you are observed by countless demons, waiting for their chance to strike. How can this be? A human walks among us. This is no place for one such as you. I shall grant you sanctuary. Fortunate an angel of Bethel found you. Were it an agent of chaos in my stead, you may not be alive. Remain calm and keep still. You will be safe momentarily. No matter how many times I look, it's the same seemingly endless sea of sun. It's safe to assume this isn't a dream. You decide to move onward for now. Save! 
in case I get um, defeated by the first imp, it is quite possible for it to crit you after all. <laughs> Uh, I remember that from my first playthrough. Young man, if you wish to live, take my hand. themselves known again after all this time knowledge and life have remained separate until now perhaps the future is secured light or dark you may chase whatever you please i shall await you in the realm beyond the earth and heavens until then, may your newfound power guide your survival. Young man, can you hear me? Yes, I can. You and I are now one. We have ascended to become a being known as Anahobina. Our form is based on my own appearance. But your knowledge seems to be the basis of our consciousness. I shall obey your will. Command me in battle, that we may best fight as one. I swear, if you miss this attack... Mm. What 
do I want to go with this time? I love using magic. In all fairness. I kind of want to try out being a strength fail. I think I'm just gonna go with magic. All hostile targets eliminated. This place is what is now called the Netherworld. It seems its demon inhabitants were targeting you. Correct. Descendants of the gods of old known now as demons. Furthermore, this is home to the demons, the netherworld. But do not worry. I, Protofiend Algami, am here to assist you. Together, we have become a being known as a Nahobino. This new body should allow us to fend off the demons. Let us keep this form until we reach a safe location. I'd like you to go here, as it should help us get a better grasp of this world. You seem worn out from that last battle. Perhaps you should gather some Magatsuhi. This world is filled with Magatsuhi. Brimming with spiritual power, it is the source of a demon's strength. The lights you see around us are the crystallized forms of Magatsuhi. What? Young man, can you not see them? Perhaps you aren't accustomed to your new body just yet. Focus, and try looking again. Were you able to see them? Yes, those are Magatsuhi crystals. Magatsuhi can give us strength as well. If you see any, don't hesitate to claim it for yourself. Three color dice I can see. Green resource a tree, yellow mana, red. Oh, okay. Observe, young man. This land is known as the Netherworld. I've heard that this place was once known as Tokyo. But that time has passed. Now it is the Netherworld, a land dominated by demons. Hmm. I'm afraid I lack the data needed to answer your inquiry right now, young man. All I can remember is that there was a battle here in days past, between gods and demons. Two great forces clashed right here in front of Tokyo Tower. I know this because I was there as well. 
Despite this, however, the data containing my memory of what followed has been damaged. The only other memory I have is of my mission to protect you. Young man, perhaps we could make our way to Tokyo Tower? If we return to the last location in my memory, I may be able to remember something else. This blue pillar of light with my data, I have concluded this is a ley line fount. A ley line fount is a point from which the Earth's energy overflows. As one might surmise, it holds incredible power. Not only can it heal those who touch it, but it can also instantly teleport one to another location. Considering the damage sustained in your previous battle, I recommend you verify its healing capabilities. Peculiar one, aren't you? Really now? You want to know where you are? <laughs> Why, this is the place I call home. As you can plainly see, I'm a bit of a collector of sorts. It's easy living. What with the riffraff out there and me in here? <laughs> Still, a demon like you's a first. One body, sure, but I can sense two spirits within, no doubt about it. <laughs> <laughs> Pleasure having you. You may call me Gustav. See something you like? It's all yours. For a small fee, of course. <laughs> so, off to Tokyo Tower, are we? And you found little old me while trying to harvest the power of the ley line found, yes? <laughs> then you ought to do yourself a favor and make a purchase. <laughs> I'll sell you what you crave, long as you've got the marker. Give yourself an edge against the demons, why don't you? to send you back on your way. Before that, however, I couldn't help but think our meeting like this must be fate. So perhaps you can do me a favor. I'm rather taken with the human knickknacks and relics of yore, so I got some pawns to go out and fetch them for me. Mimon, they're called. Trouble is, they're fickle, and even worse, forgetful. Oftentimes, they give up the search and do whatever they please. <sighs> Useless. That said, if you happen to run across any, mind sending them back old Gustav's direction? I'll see to it you're rewarded. <laughs> Also, I've taken liberty to connect this place to the ley line fount. Feel free to come and go as you fancy. <laughs> Till next time! Oh, yes, of course! Here, allow me to show you the ins and outs of the ley line fount. I can use the flow to heal you if you fancy. 
But I can't do it for free. <laughs> Cough up a little maca, however, I'll set you right his reign. Be good to remember that. Hey. There was an unexpected meeting, but we were able to confirm the Found's capabilities. As we make our way to Tokyo Tower, I recommend we look for the Mimon, as we were asked. Young man, could that be one of the Mimon we were told about? We've located a Mimon. We should report back to Cadaver's Hollow. We've located a Mimo. <laughs> Found a Mimon already, have we? My thanks, friend. I got just the thing to show my appreciation. This is an essence. It contains the power of a demon. Power that only the Chosen can wield. You'll want to make your merry way over to the Leyline Fount in Nita. Someone there will be able to tell you more, I'm sure. <laughs> Perchance bring more Maka next time. the wrong direction. Young man, it appears there's a demon up ahead. I have a proposal. It's dangerous to travel the netherworld alone. Therefore, I recommend we recruit some demons to fight on our side. By talking to demons, you can try and persuade them to join your cause. I have a lifestone you can use. See if you can convince the demon to join you.
Well done, young man. If there is a demon you want on your side, then you might try to negotiate with them. Young man, there is a demon up ahead. Allow me to teach you an efficient way to engage the enemy. When confronting demons, the best strategy is to strike them with your blade. In many cases, this will give you the initiative in the battle. On the other hand, if you are attacked, the enemy may very well gain the initiative instead. Observe the enemy's movements and act accordingly to earn an advantage in battle. Let's see. Oh, that's new. That was unexpectedly easy. I say that, but that took most of my HP. Young man. This will grant you access to an orbital satellite and gives you a better view of your surroundings. An orbital satellite. <laughs> Tree. worry about you. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thanks, Pixie. Hello there. Go back to the park and Hello. Yeah. Don't want to eat me? Not a lot of flavor, you know? Trust me! A 
relief? Seriously, thanks. You really saved me back there. Huh? You know, now that I think about it... I, like, totally had the judgment to ask for your help. So doesn't that make me awesome, too? Okay, never mind then. Like, you deserve thanks anyway. The only reason I'm alive is because I asked you for help, and you know it. Don't try to deny it, either. <laughs> the demon in the kimono has rather liberally interpreted the situation. What will you do? Nah, I'm not that bad. Huh? Oh, what, you're worried about me? <laughs> oh, you're sweet. Yep, I'm just fine. All good over here. Wait a sec. I just realized I've never seen you before, huh? <laughs> wow, how weird. So, so who are you? Hmm? Where are you headed? Young man, there are demons in this world that feign kindness to prey on you. I say ignore her and move on. What? Hey, you're leaving? Like, seriously? Uh, well, well, fine! See if I care! The demon in the kimono left. Okay. Um, don't mind me. Please let me up the rock. Uh Rick, Rick, Rick! Get away from me! Where are they? Oh, there it is, it's a normal rock. This is a good stopping point. That way I can put in more story in each episode, you know? So, for anyone watching, thank you very much for watching. Wow, maybe I should have just started with the thank you because saying that now I just realized it's kind of redundant. Ah, uh, crud. Anyway, <clears throat> I sincerely hope you enjoyed Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance. Please do consider liking, commenting, or subscribing down below if you enjoyed the way I play the game, I, I guess. Or if you enjoy my witty commentary, um, if any. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> with that as our ending note, I bid you all bye-bye, for now anyway. <laughs>